As we head out into fall and going into all the cold evenings and little crisp temps, um, you want to have your plants, your planters, either outdoors, under a covered porch, um, and just kind of start with the basic plants, the mums, the cabbage, the kale, the hookahs, some of those, um, even some of the peppers and the, the creeping jennies will take a little bit of a frost. But once it gets to the hard frost, then we're gonna have to be replacing a few of those in and out of the planters. You wanna have um, the option of doing a little whimsy. You want to have an open space in your planter that you can pop something in, say um, orange pansies, and then once Halloween's over, pull it out and put a cabbage. And those will take snow on their faces, so they'll go clear through the Thanksgiving holidays. The fall planters that we have here at the Home and Garden Store are combinations of some of the best cold-loving plants. You can buy the larger pots and you can have the height in the back with the, the cabbage and the kale, even some of the grasses. Go lower with a, a colorful mum, place a pumpkin on the side for a little whimsy. Um, really anything, any arrangement depending on the size of your patio and your, your porch. You want that welcoming feel when you come home, oh yeah, it's fall, it's Halloween, it's Thanksgiving, and the look is very welcoming and very uh, seasonal here. Care for most of these planters are just a, a regular watering. If they are outside and they do get the rain, you're still going to need to touch them up a little bit because uh, mums especially, the water sheds off the top. So you want to get underneath and, and give the planter a good little dose of water, maybe every other day, every three days. If it's sunny out, um, and who knows in, in Ohio, um, especially Cleveland, what we're going to get. So kind of do the finger test and, and see how they're, they're faring. These plants are grown in Ohio. They started them in July, so they're acclimated already to the current weather. Um, we pick varieties that grow well in Ohio, and depending on the frost, if we have a late frost, the plants will last for in indefinitely. And if uh, there's a hard frost, well, that's Mother Nature. As you've heard me say many times before, I love color. Uh, fall is my favorite. The colors, the burgundies, the rich yellows, the rusts, Combining those into um, a planter is sort of your personal preference. We have them ready-made, designed by Laura. She does a wonderful job. She enjoys doing it. It shows. Um, but if you're the creative type and you want to do your own, you're the gardener at heart, then take those uh, plants that speak to you. Do a monochromatic theme. Do a whimsy theme. Um, really, whatever pleases you and makes you happy. Mm -hmm.